My name is Jeff Margolis. I live in Van Zandt, Washington. I want you to set aside the concept of a mainline railroad and think in terms of systems, system security and systems redundancy. Um, advanced industrial systems always engineer for contingencies, theoretical. Uh, I live and work next to the farmland uh, route. I own and operate everybody's store. I've been there for 42 years. My business straddles the intersection where the rail meets SR9. I've been watching BNSF upgrade this rail, installing the heaviest gauge ribbon rail since last winter. Right now they're restoring ballast. Uh, the city of Burlington is receiving $11 million for bridge improvement. The Canadian National Railway has recently spent $300 million on improvements to track between um, Sumas and West Shore. In the year 2000, the Cascadia Transportation Plan forecasted 47 freight and passenger trains per day coming up through this region before any dream of coal. Uh, surely uh, professionals are familiar with the Cascadia Institute, the Farmhouse Gang, uh, the State of Washington's uh, rail plans. Uh, the coastal route needs a pressure relief valve and that valve is the farmland route through eastern Whatcom County. Um, the Whatcom County is more concerned about adverse impacts and dimming than uh, routes through Wyoming. Yesterday, headlines were about from uh, the Whatcom County Assessor was questioning the impact uh, of this on land values in Whatcom County. So take this farmland route a little more seriously, will you folks? The portent of uh, is for overpasses to re relieve vehicular delays. People spoke about uh, medical emergencies. Um, there are nine critical crossings from one end of the county to the other. 